Hello everyone. Welcome to MS SAP Tip webcast. In this video, we are going to see the steps on how to manage local user group membership with Microsoft Intune. In Intune, if subset of users needs to have local administrator rights, there are several ways to grant users these rights. For example, via a separate autopilot profile where you specify that users needs to be local administrator or via the additional local administrators on all Azure AD joint devices option in the Azure AD device settings. Although in that case, they will become administrator on all Azure AD joint devices, which is not recommended when they only needs to be admin on their specific device. A good alternative is to give the user the admin rights via the local user group membership policy by making the user member of the local administrators group via Microsoft Intune. Local user group membership policies help Intune admin to add, remove or replace members of local groups on Windows devices. It just like the restricted group membership which we have seen in group policy. We can manage local groups with on-prem domain users groups and Azure AD users group SIDs. In the policy, we specify which user or group needs to have local admin rights. Next, we assign this policy to a group of devices where the policy should be applied on. Let's learn how to create a local user group membership policy to manage local admins of Windows 10 or Windows 11 devices. This local user group membership policy is supported for hybrid Azure AD joint and Azure AD joint devices. First, sign in to the Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center as a global administrator or an Intune service administrator. We can access Microsoft Endpoint Manager using the URL https endpoint.microsoft.com. On home page, click on Groups. We have created one taste device group named Taste Win Client. Click on Group Name. Under Manage, click on Members. We can see the Windows 10 device named Lab Win 10 CLI01 is listed as a member of this group. We will create local user group membership policy and apply it to this group. Let's go to a Windows 10 device. This is our Azure AD joint Windows 10 device with the name lab win 10 hyphen CLI 01. Right click on start menu and select computer management. Expand local users and groups. Click on groups. Double click on built in group name administrators. Note down current members of this group. Only test user 2 is added as a member to this group. After applying the policy, we will again check group membership. Let's go back to Microsoft Endpoint Manager. Click on Users. We want to assign administrator rights to our user test user 1 on our Windows 10 device using local user group membership policy. Click on Endpoint Security. Under Manage, click on Account Protection. To create a new policy, click on Create Policy plus icon. Select Windows 10 and later a platform. Click on drop down arrow and select Local User Group Membership. Click on Create to continue. Provide meaningful full name for the profile. We have given name Taste Local User Group Membership. 
let's add description click on next under local group click on drop down arrow six local groups are supported with the local user group membership policy we will need to select any of the following local user groups to remove or add members administrators group is already selected there are three options to configure the local group add update remove update and add replace add update used to add users or groups to the local group remove update used to remove users or groups from the local group and add replace used to remove all assigned users and groups and add only the specified users and groups from this policy when using the add replace option for configuring the built in administrators group it is always required to add the administrator as a member this is because the built in administrator must always be a member of the administrators group otherwise our policy will not work we have selected the add update option to add new members to the local administrator group and that options will be selected by default next comes selecting the method to identify the members which we want to add to or remove from the specified group there are two options to do this users a groups option is only supported for azure ad joint devices the manual option is supported for both azure ad joint and hybrid joint devices if you are using the add replace action then you need to add the sids using manual option because we cannot select azure ad roles within this policy i'm not going to cover manual option at the moment to add users or user groups into windows 10 or windows 11 local user groups we must select users groups from user selection type and that will be the selected by default now click on select users groups link to choose the azure ad users or groups from the search menu we will select a user named test user 1 click on select and click next to continue optionally we can add a scope tag but in this video we will go with the default tag click next in the assignments page click on add groups we will use our test device group named test win client click on select confirm test win client group is selected with one device click next review your selection and when you ready click on create button to complete the manage local administrators group policy we can see the confirmation message policy test local user group membership created successfully once the local user group membership profile has been created it's time to have a look at the configuration results go back to a windows 10 device let me close this first we will perform the manual sync with intune so let me click on sync i'm going to pause the video recording and once a sync finish i'll resume it we can see this windows 10 device has successfully completed the sync with microsoft intune let's right click on start menu select computer management click on local users and groups and click on groups double click on administrators built in group we can see this user one is successfully added to the built in administrator group So now test user 1 also has administrative rights on this Windows 10 device. We can see we have two other SIDs as member of the administrators group. Out of those two SIDs, one SID is for the Azure Global Administrators 
and the other one is for the Azure AD Joint Device Local Administrator role, which is used for the additional local administrators on all Azure AD Joint Devices feature in Azure AD Device Settings. Let me start the manual sync again with Intune. Now, let's go back to Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center. Click on Taste Local User Group Membership Policy. Click on View Report. We can see success check in status for our Windows 10 device named Lab Win 10 CLI01. Using the same steps, we can also remove Taste User 1 from the Administrators group. For that, we need to use the Remove Update option which will remove the user from the specified group while keeping the current group membership intact. That's all for this video on how to manage local user group membership with Microsoft Intune using Microsoft Endpoint Manager Admin Center web interface. Thank you all for watching this video. Have a nice day.